Hi guys, Farhan Tipu here and welcome back to the Indulge Gadgets show. Today we've got the base sports flare from Petron that are just priced at 899. Petron is one company that I've seen give out exciting products at convenient price points. Be it audio products like speakers, both wired and wireless, smartwatches or even chargers, all are available at an affordable price point. But with this slash in price, does the performance of the products also get slashed? Let's get straight to the review and check it out. In the box, you get to see these earbuds along with a USB A to Type C charging wire, two extra soft ear tips, and they have also given us a QR manual that's just a piece of paper which is cut using a scale. Scanning the QR will take us to the PDF website where we'll learn how to pair it and get familiar with the touch controls. Coming to the product, the design the company has gone with reminds me of the bonnet of a car. The case is dark blue in color and with some black on the side. At the very least, it does look a little premium. It is made of plastic with a glossy finish overall, which means it can get scratches easily. The case is compact in size and has a charging port at the back of it. The lid of the case is also magnetic and of decent build quality. And you can see that there are LED lights as well. You get a variety of colors displayed through the LED lights present on the case. When we open the case, you see that the earbuds have been placed with magnets. So you need not worry about them falling out of the case. You get to see that these earbuds have a glossy finish to them. They have given the logo on the stem and you get to see lights on them as well. But these work just once to show that they're pairing and they work in a breathing light. The design looks simple with no buttons given so that we can conclude that they're touch sensitive earbuds. Coming to the hardware, these earbuds are equipped with 13mm dynamic drivers. I've used these buds and I can say that they deliver some mind blowing, no no scratch that, some ear blowing out audio and I mean it. They are really loud when I put my volume to the max and it's a painful kind of loud and not the pleasant loudness that you get to see. While using these bass pods flare, I noticed that the music was either too low or too high. Like what I mean to say is even when I kept the audio at 60%, they were a little low but when I put it to max, they were really really loud. My ears also started to pain. I mean you can give these to people who are hard of hearing and they might also say it's too loud. It felt really disturbing and I kept thinking that they will burst my eardrums anytime, which isn't a plus point for me. The name bass pods somewhat did stand true since I felt the bass on a decent level, but I didn't feel that good of a bass even for the bass boosted songs. But the flare in this name stood right, it flared up my eardrums. I also tried these buds for gaming in Call of Duty and they didn't seem to be any lag at least. For connectivity, we have been given the Bluetooth 5.3 version. The connection range is 15 meters without any obstacles. You can connect it to your Android, iOS or even laptop and because of the latest Bluetooth, the connection speed to your device is almost instant. We have also been given microphones that offer the ENC mode that helps the user take calls without any hesitancy of not being heard clearly. Next, you are provided with the IPX4 water resistance certifications. So for those of you who are out there in the rain, sweating, like going to the gym or things like that, it's at your own risk. We also get to see the voice assistance support on these tier buds. Now with all the features that I covered, let me just talk a little about the battery life. The company claims that we get up to 35 hours of playtime and it takes one and a half hours to get your case to full charge. So coming to my final opinion on this TWS product, let me just start off with the good before I dive into the bad. The pros for me here are its price and that there is low latency available on these earbuds, which I actually didn't expect when I saw the price. The different color lights on the case are also a nice thing to see. Now starting off with the cons. To begin with, the case is a copied style. Now I don't know who made it first, but I came across this design on the Wings Phantom last year and that's that. No originality except in the price maybe. Moving on to the LED lights on the case, even though they give out a variety of different colors, these colors kept staying on for quite some time and by that I mean like 5 to 10 minutes when the earbuds are placed in. Now coming to the earbuds, its design is copied, except for the logo on the stem. The performance of these 13mm dynamic drivers in these buds is a little too dangerous according to me. It made me get nauseous and it made my ears hurt on max volume. Like they told on Flipkart, the 13mm dynamic drivers ensures immersive audio with a punchy bass. And to that it's definitely true. It definitely punched my ears to a pulp. I don't see why they couldn't have gone with the IPX5 water rating at least when they offered us the Bluetooth 5.3 here. They should have at least put the Bluetooth 5.1 and upped the water resistance. Now this is the part in the review where I usually say who can buy it and it took me quite some thinking to see who or what kind of people would want this. 
So these earbuds are for those people who love loud music and don't worry about damaging their hearing capabilities. I'm kidding, but it's just I really can't think of any situation where the people would be really happy with this. Now, if you say you don't want to spend a lot on them, then for the same price range, you can go for many, many other options that go in the wired headphone segment. And those would offer safe sound volumes as well as a good performance. So that's it for today, guys. I hope I've answered all your doubts. And if you have any more questions regarding this product, please leave them in the comment section below and I'll be sure to get back to you. See you in the next video.